Okay, in this video we're going to look at putting uh, a teleporter into a map in Alien Arena. So I'm going to draw us a small box room. It doesn't have to be anything special. Now what the teleporters will let you do is basically teleport from uh, one level to another or one area to another. You can basically do whatever you want with them and you can control the flow of your level. So we've just about got this room built or ready to build and we'll press T for a texture and we'll just apply any texture to it and then we'll hollow it out and we can go inside the room now what we're going to do is we're going to place as always a light so we can see and um, we'll set that we'll leave it at 500 then we're going to go and place an info player deathmatch uh, because this would be a deathmatch map um, so we're going to drag it over there and put it into the middle beautiful right now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to place a teleporter at the end of the room um, and it's really simple to do. We press escape so that we can deselect everything and then uh, what we'll do is we'll right click on one of our orthographic views, doesn't matter which. Um, we'll right click and we'll choose, uh, we'll go down to misc and we'll choose uh, in misc teleporter. Okay, so now we've got this red box looking thing. We'll bring it down onto the level of the floor and we'll, we'll put that basically around about middle. Okay, now that's basically where we'll walk into. We'll see the teleporter, uh, the look, you know, the, the green teleporter glow just appearing up out of the floor there. But obviously we need to tell that teleporter where it's going to go. So we need to put another entity in the map. And we're going to put uh, this other one under MISC. We'll go to MISC and... Oh, autosave. We'll go to MISC and we see MISC teleporter destination. So we'll drag that into the map and uh, we'll put it into the corner there and what we'll do just so we know we've been teleported there so we can see it happen I'll just draw a brush in front of the teleporter I'll give it a bit of space and uh, I'll draw a brush there and we'll give it a different texture we'll give it that one just so we know that we've teleported there and we'll be able to see it change okay now we need to give we need to link these up because you can have numerous teleporters in a map. So we need to be able to tell the game that when you hit that teleporter pad over there, you're going to be transported to this one. Now you could have another teleporter at that end, maybe next to it, and have it transport you to this area here. Uh, but what we need to do is we need to link these together to say where you're going to go. So we'll select our teleporter first and we'll press N to bring up the Entities Inspector and we'll see up here it says point teleporters at these um, target is teleport destination so what we'll do is we'll do target teleport you can give it any name you want target needs to remain the same but the value can change to anything you want so we've called it teleport and then we press escape to deselect this item then we'll go to this item over here shift click bring up the entities window and now we'll give it a target name and again it needs to be teleport because we want that transporter to link with this one so we'll call it teleport we'll hit enter press escape and now we see that red line going across which lets us know that the uh, transporter is linked to the destination so we'll save the map and we'll call it teleport hit enter and then we'll build it using the batch file we talked about in a couple of videos back build teleport okay so that's now been built so we can actually launch that and uh, give it a test okay so the game's loaded up we'll type in map teleport because that's the name of the map that we built and we'll wait for that to load and while that's loading um, basically teleporters are just like triggers and things like that they need to be targeted to to each other and we'll see we've got these lovely flashing effects and we've got a teleporter down the end we want to go over there so uh, let's give it a go a way to respawn and we'll jump in see we've been transported instantly and how cool is that so that's very simple transporter that shows you how it works now don't worry about it 
the actual glowing entity flying up there. The transporter isn't moving. I can still walk here and still be transported. There's just a small issue in the game at the moment. Not too sure why it happens. But you can keep doing this all day. And uh, you'll always be facing the way you can point the transporter destination in the way you want as well. Which is uh, pretty cool. So that's basically it. That basically shows you how to create a teleporter and set the destination of it. Right, thanks very much for watching the video. I'll see you soon.